Hi Cancer, welcome back. This is going to be your general quickie reading for week of January 21st. The uh, reading goes out about two weeks, they're bi-weeklies. Um, checking out for my in-depth love spreads, I do those every other week. If you're new to me, welcome. If you're returning, thank you. If uh, it resonates, please do like, share, and subscribe. Lots of cancers walking this earth. It's not going to be for all of you. Um, and also, check out my social media account links down in the description box below. So, see what we got going on. Ooh, okay, cancer. For starting week of January 21st. So, Cancer, recent past, Two of Pentacles in the reverse, the Lovers, and then the Eight of Pentacles. Mm. All right. <laughs> I also got my dog in the background today. She cute. Anyways, um, Cancer, I feel like whatever indecisiveness had was going on, you have made a decision to put your focus on yourself, work, career. It's almost like to hell with the rest. <laughs> That's the message I got right away. Um, particularly if you, you know, you might have had a lot going on, and that's kind of where your focus needs to be, particularly uh, on money, even. Okay. But I can see there's another group of you here, so let me get this message out first. Wow, your cards are just like flying out. Hold on. I wasn't ready for them all, but okay. So coming up, uh, present energy, you've got the king of wands in the reverse. Uh, justice and then nine of wands. I feel like the energy cancer is like <sighs> trying to be more decisive. Um, but I feel like there's an, there's an energy of stubbornness here. Um, watch your temper, um, this week. Okay. I do feel like you're trying to, like I said, be more decisive, make more decisions, particularly in the career sector. Um, some of you might be waiting on a judgment, um, or a decision, um, regarding like your stability, finances, etc. And I feel like you're kind of disappointed. I feel like you might have put a lot of work into your career. Um, for some of you, this is your home. Um, and for a few of you, it's a partnership. I'll get to that in a minute. And it's kind of disappointed. You might have gotten some disappointing communication. Um, might didn't you might not have gotten the results that you wanted, or as much as you thought you were gonna get. Particularly if this is, like I said, uh, a legal judgment or some type of legal contract involved here. All right, but I feel like Aries, regardless, you're trying to maintain your composure here, um, keep things under control. Like I said. You're, you're trying to balance out your own energy. But I do definitely pick up some disappointment. Now, for those of you that this is not pertaining to, like, legalities, money, career, I feel like if this is a love partnership, and you can be in one of the groups or all of them, but I feel like as it come, pertains to love, it's just... Yeah, disappointment. <laughs> it's like the same message. Um, cancer, you might have been going back and forth um, about a decision um, in love. You know, but I feel like whether you're in a long-term relationship or single, like the love department is a bit disappointing. All right. You might have um, been vulnerable with somebody, let your guard down, or that might be what you're doing. This is actually in your future energy, so I see this more as a, more of a caution. There might be somebody that you currently have your guard up with, and in the future energy, you might try to be a little bit vulnerable with them and communicate how you're 
feeling and it might end up in disappointment. You know, they may not understand where you're coming from or you, you don't get um, the response that you want, you know. And this may make you want to kind of shut yourself off, really. Remember, this is a temporary energy, only in the next two weeks. But I have a lot of waiting cards here, and um, I feel like, like I said, the focus is very heavy on working on yourself, focusing on things you can control. Um, yeah. Like I said, uh, Cancer, you need to control your temper if you've been temperamental, and I see that some of you have. Some of you, this is not you, this is someone external to you that has <laughs> been temperamental, um, focused on the negative, <sighs> not watching how they communicate or how they make other people feel or how they make you feel. And you might, yeah, like I said, kind of close yourself off to this person, okay? But for the majority of you, I feel like love is not necessarily the focus the next two weeks. It's a lot of focus on, like I said, your stability. There's some legalities going on for a lot of you. Um, trying to put work in to your home or to yourself, to your career. That's a pretty heavy message for most of you. But for a few of you, this is a partnership. For some of you, it's both. So that's what I have. I do feel like um, you will be able to maintain your composure, though, despite everything that may be going on. Um, and also, you know, I do feel like you have somebody in your midst, likely a friend, that is offering some advice uh, or help that will, will that will actually help you be able to move forward into a better energy. So don't ignore the people around you that are trying to um, be of assistance here. So Cancer, uh, Zodiac signs I have here. I've got a Gemini, Libra, could be Aquarius, um, Sagittarius, Virgo, Aries, possibly a Leo. Maybe an earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, like I said. So, let me know how it resonates. I wish you all the very best. That was a quickie reading. Catch my in-depth readings every other week. And until then, I wish you the very best, Cancer. Namaste.